is episode 16 of season 2 of that time I got reincarnated as a slime. Let's get started. Link in the description that will send you to Crunchyroll. Bring the episode down to zero. Then we're going to play at the same time. So, when you're ready. In 3, 2, 1, go. Tempest. While we're in this little bit here. Uh, so you guys are aware, I have a new camera. That's why I look a bit more framey. <laughs> and slightly more realistic. But not by a lot. Just more. That's a good question. She just kind of showed up and then fainted. Oh, shit. All right. Was that, is that is her butler? <laughs> Wasn't affecting them to know how to speak. Yeah, are you? <laughs> God, remember it turns fucking everyone into neats. <laughs> oh, that's right. It, it was a warning. Completely forgot about that, actually. <laughs> it's just, she just kind of like, she dove in. With all this gravitas, and then just like lost it all, <laughs> like really quickly. So I just like okay, it's doomed to fall. It's yeah, probably because he's like oh he's a, he's a demon lord now, and now like some of the higher up demon lords want to kill him, so they're just gonna make sure the place is destroyed. Something like that. Who knows? What <laughs> point? I think the problem is that Rimmer, who's himself very powerful and has very, very strong allies, including Veldora, <laughs> like the strongest. <laughs> I don't know if he's the strongest. He was defeated, I guess. But, you know, just in general, he's very strong. So <laughs> there's that. Although, I feel like at the same time, he, remember, I probably wouldn't want to rely on Veldora's strength alone, because he did the same thing with Milam. It's like, this isn't your problem, it's our problem. Although, I feel like at the same time, Veldora is more of a resident of Tempest now than, like, Milam ever was. Because Milam was just kind of there visiting, being like, yo, you're my friend now, I want to hang out. And Veldora, I'm assuming, lives here. Who wasn't panicking? <laughs> Demon Lord's Banquet? Oh, great. <laughs> and they just start wars, just cause. It's just maybe once a war happened, <laughs> and that's what they just assumed it was. Hmm. 
Mm. Well, he is. <laughs> mm. He should uh crash the party. Hmm. <laughs> well. They have the key to make sure this doesn't happen. It's like, oh, she's right here. <laughs> I hope Veldora is just in every background scene reading manga. What do you mean? She's right there. <laughs> See, everyone looks at her. I guess it's her. <laughs> well, this changes a lot. <laughs> <laughs> She's so adorable. Well, he did. Okay. <laughs> Can any demon lord show up to these? I was gonna say, like, it's in three hours. Why don't you go? <laughs> <laughs> I love her <laughs> too much so I took a break All right. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Are you normally over on the curl side? Well, I guess since they're here, it's be a bit more applicable to be there. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> nice shot. I hit him without even looking. That'd be weird. Mm. More roads. Let's go. Uh, yeah. Mm. Damn, <laughs> nice. That's fair. That sounds like a fair deal. It's like you get you build a road, you get to toll it, but you get led us to be like, hey, let's adjust this a little bit, huh? Huh? Uninvited guest, maybe? Oh. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> Don't you rust? Why are you here? <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> I love how the, the druid is just glowing. <laughs> I guess she's glowing too. They probably want their queen around a little bit. She's technically their queen, right? Something like that? It's something like that, at least. <laughs> She's like a doll. <laughs> Uh -huh. That sounds terrifying. <laughs> She's adorable. <laughs>
Hmm. Nice, they're all doubling down, being like, yeah, fuck the church. Years, he's been there for years. He's that strong. They're all very confused because the magic users switched bodies. Oh, <laughs> it's fine. Well, you probably would have done the same thing if I'm being honest. <laughs> <laughs> Diablo wants to stay with you. It's <laughs> my, my cue. <laughs> uh, <laughs> appears. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Big ol' he's giving you the middle finger, guys. You really? <laughs> He seems concerned about something. Hmm. 
It's probably a diversion. He wants to kill them all. Answer. Oh, cool. So he needs sacrifices. Gotta stop him before that. Mm. Oh no, <laughs> it's over. <laughs> Wait, I was getting really invested in this episode. All right, well, I'm super fucking fascinated with this one. I'm, so my assumption is, well, they're obviously not going to be able to move their entire fucking army over there to defend everything. It's going to be way too slow. But maybe an elite force of their strongest could go over there pretty quickly, I'd imagine. And that'd be way more than enough to defeat 30,000 soldiers. Like, Rimuru fucking alone could defeat probably all of them easily. Maybe not the finger. Who knows? But I, it depends on how strong he is. I don't think he's strong enough to fight a demon lord, though. So, we'll see. <laughs> uh, I'm super fascinated and excited. It looks like we're going to get some pretty epic battles coming up soon. So, that would be awesome. Uh, and if you guys enjoyed this reaction, like, comment, and subscribe because it super helps on the channel. Also, click that notification bell so you know when the next one is live. Other than that, thank you for coming to the party.